Good morning, everybody. I don't know what time it is, but uh, I just want to share this with you. I believe that it's very important for everybody to get a backdrop on what happened with me with the Gone with the Wind video, uh, video that I had put out in 2018. It was an utterance I had. And just to give you a quick backdrop also on the beginning of the video, because I'm not going to play it, but... Uh, Sis Amanda and I were on the phone. We were talking about things and she was telling me about a dream she had and another dream another sister had and they were it was pointing to basically November. Um and of course we don't know what year, but I also want to say it seemed like it could be the year 2019 because this was in 2018. And, well, I just wasn't having it. I was going, la, 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 la. You know how little kids stick their fingers in their ears and like, la, 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 la. I, I didn't want to hear it, you guys, because uh, I was ready to go then. And I am still ready to go right now. <clears throat> and, excuse me, y'all. And then also, um, I was given the number 221. And what I believe now is because of the Hebrew you know, Jesus was a Jew. He was a Hebrew. And, well, uh, the number 221 in the Hebrew gematria, or whatever you want to call it, in the numerical value, um, the number zero is of no value, so they don't use it. So, 221. Now, do I know we're going this year? No, I do not. But I will say this. I just did a dream interpretation for our sister, Lori Badastoni. And oh my goodness, y'all. And I'll be putting that out in the next couple of days. And also, this is part one of part two. Uh, there's just too much to share with y'all. And I just want to give my new subs a backdrop, okay, of what's going on here. But anyways, let's take a listen. Oh, and listen to the end. And this correlates between me, Amanda, Earl, and Patrick L. Here we go. After I got off the phone with her, <laughs> I was, uh, I was uh, praying to the Lord, and uh, I talked to him just like I talked to you guys, just like I talked to anybody. But, you know, there's some prayers that are really in reverence and in awe for the Lord. And then there are some where I'm just like just talking to him. And I was just saying, Lord, when are we going? Is it going to be next year, Father? Do we got to wait till November of next year? Eh. You know, I was crying like a little baby. <laughs> and, uh, well, you know, throughout. You guys, listen to the end because. Well, that's why I sound the way I sound, because I was crying, because I haven't heard this in a long time. And at the end of this, it makes me cry every time, y'all. So let's listen. My entire lifetime, you guys, I've uh, had utterances. And it started when I was young. The first utterance I can remember, I think I was in my early, well, I don't know. Anyways, I've had utterances for a very long time. I think I was right around 30 years old. Okay. And these utterances, when I have them, they come out without me thinking. I'm not thinking about it. It just comes out. Okay. And then it comes exactly true. So that is an utterance of the spirit when that happens. And you're like, where did that come from? I don't even know why you said it, right? Uh, so, I'm talking to the Lord and um, asking Him to please, and every time I've ever asked the Lord to please get personalized something, to show me something, and to make it so that it can't be fabricated by anything else, and that I know it come, it is coming from Him and nowhere else. And uh, please make it personal. So that it just cannot be just random, okay? A random confirmation. Well, he did that in a big, big way. So, let me explain. The day I put out the video that a 
speaking out the gospel. I don't know if you guys have watched it or not. Um, in that particular video, I said that our sins are known. No, I said something to this manner. Okay, I don't remember exactly what I said, except for one part. I said, your sins are forgiven from the east to the west, east to the west, gone with the wind. And I've, I've never said that before. And as I was saying it, and when I'm speaking out the gospel, it just keeps coming out, you guys. The Holy Spirit kind of takes over and it just goes out of me, pretty much. And um, as I was speaking it, and I said that, your sins are remembered no more from the east to the west gone with the wind, I thought to myself in my mind, where did that come from? And, well, I just kept going and speaking the gospel. So, I just didn't think about it no more. Okay, so after I got done with making that video, you guys, I did think about it, and I was like, well, that must have been an utterance. Um, and I still believe it's an utterance, and I still believe there's more to come. So anyways, let's go on. But I thought, wow, that was a little odd, you know? That's not something I ever say, ever have said in any of my videos when I'm speaking of the gospel. Uh, so, I believe it was that night, I believe it was... Um, Either the day prior, well, the, when I was making the gospel video, that was a, a day or so prior to Thanksgiving Day. And so, Thanksgiving Day night, you know, we're all busy during the Thanksgiving holidays, you guys. Sorry about the little dog yelling in the background, you guys. It's my neighbor's dog down the street. She hates being put outside, and she yells the whole time. But anyways, um neither here nor there, just ignore it, if you can hear it, I don't know if you can hear it, um, but anyways, let's see, where was I, oh, that night, I decided to go and look at the comments, late that night, and I saw that our brother Earl had put a comment to me, he says, um, happy Thanksgiving to you, Mr. and Mrs. Rich, and then he said, by the way, Karen and I are sitting here watching the movie Gone with the Wind. I was like, whoa, pretty neat. And I immediately thought of my mama because, you know, my mama, uh, that was her favorite movie of all time, Gone with the Wind. And you know, and it also to me, a little bit later as I thought about it, well, gone with the wind, gone with the Holy Spirit, raptured. <laughs> you know, the wind is the Spirit. Uh, one reference to it, one reference to him, I should say. Um, and so, after Amanda and I had spoke about that, um, I believe it was during that period of time there where the Gone with the Wind, oh no, that was after. And because um, we were talking about it and she was saying, no, I think it might be next year. And I was like, la, 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 la. <laughs> I was joking around. And I was like, no, 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 no. And then I saw that from Brother Earl about Gone with the Wind. And then... Later on, I saw that she left me a link. And because I told her about my utterance, and I think, I believe I told her about uh, Brother Earl had said that about God with the wind, also. And I'm trying to remember how this all went, you guys. Um, and then she left me a link. And so later on, I went back into the computer. And I saw that she had left me a link. She says, you don't, you're not going to believe what popped up in my feed. So I pushed on it, right? And I thought, okay, what is it? Let me go check it out. What's Amanda's 
sending me. And this is what she sent me. Now, i got to give you a little backdrop on this, too. For two days in a row, you guys know my sleep patterns are all over the place. Um, for two days in a row, I woke up at exactly 2.21. And I looked at the clock and I was like, oh, 2.21 again. Huh. So, and one more thing about myself. Uh, I have this little habit, sometimes, not all the time, it's whenever, that I'll say something three times. Now, I've been doing this for years and years and years. And because the number three is my favorite number because of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. And number 333 is my favorite number because of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit times three, you see? So, like, you know, if I want something to manifest or to, I'll say it sometimes, three times, you guys. It's just a little silly little thing I've done for a very, very, very long time, for as long as I can remember. So, she sent me this link. Okay? And I want to remind you one more thing. I had looked up a little thing about God with the wind after I talked with her. Um, and it, it was Wikipedia, I believe, and it showed the book of Gone with the Wind. Because I wanted to look up on it because I hadn't watched that movie in years and years, you guys. And uh, it was talking about the Civil War in that movie. And martial law. And there were a couple of things that I can't remember right now, but it's neither here nor there, so I don't want to make the video too long. But anyways, I'm going to play what she sent me. Now remember 221? And remember three times. And remember gone with the wind. Here we go. It's 221 a.m. Sunday, November 4th, 2018. My message is simple and quick. And if I said nothing else and just ended this video after saying it, that would be it. The message is, we're out of here. And for some reason, I feel I should say it three times, so two more times. We're out of here. We're out of here. So that's three times I said it. Okay, I'm going to stop that right there. Uh... That just gave me the goosebumps again. She didn't know about the 221, and she didn't know about the three times. She had no clue. And, because I don't go around saying, oh, sometimes I say something three times to, you know, to try to enforce it or make it happen or, you know, it's just a silly little stupid thing I do. And, um, when I heard this, I was... Lord, because I had prayed to the Lord again for a sign of something personal to let me know that we are going soon and it is not going to be in November and that I was going to be okay and Andy was going to be okay because we got some medical that need to be taken care of uh, and uh, you know and you know um, well we just don't have the money for it so, yeah, I'm praying for a really quick rapture, you guys. And uh, when I heard this, I was blown away. Blown away. I will leave the link to this video. And uh, one more thing. Two more things. I went and I told Amanda, I said, you're not going to believe this. I said, I do that all the time, about saying something three times. And also, the 221, the clock, the time in the beginning of this video. And she said to me, did you see the thumbnail? <clears throat> that means the beginning of the page, you guys, when you all see the title. Case you don't have videos and you don't upload videos and I said no why she says the thumbnail on this video is the book gone with the wind Now I had a dream about a year 
Okay, I'm going to stop it right there, you guys. I just want to say one more thing. Another thing that Patrick said in that video, he had made that video before I made mine about the Gone with the Wind, y'all. This video right here. Of course, he had to have made it before that. I say we're out of here all the time. And anybody that knows me knows that I do that. I asked the Lord for personal confirmations. Now, in 2018, when I made this video, I was thinking, gee, well, I need to get out of here now. But the Lord has kept Andy and I all this time. And do I think it's this year? This is just my personal thought. Yeah, I do. Yes, I do. I think we're, we will be out of here 2021. Do I know when? No, I do not. Um, I do think things are going to progress. But I just wanted to share this with you. I wanted to give you a backdrop on my next videos. The next one I'll be putting out will prob probably be this evening. Anyways, I pray this has blessed you. You guys have a beautiful and wonderful day in our Lord. And that is what I pray for everyone. Amen and amen.